This not too difficult recipe serves six people. You will need 500 grams of lean minced lamb. It might be known as ground lamb. One level teaspoon of dried rosemary. One 400 gram tin of cannellini beans. Two onions, two carrots, two sticks of celery. 250 grams chestnut mushrooms. One heaped tablespoon of plain flour. 800 millilitres of chicken or vegetable stock or a mixture of the two. 800 grams of potatoes minimum. Two tablespoons of milk. Peel the onions and carrots, trim the celery and wipe the mushrooms clean. Then finally chop it all or do it in a food processor. Peel the potatoes, cut them into chunks, put them in a saucepan, wash them under running water. And leave them covered with cold water. Put the mince ground lamb into a large pan that has a lid. Cook over a high heat for about 15 minutes to brown. Break it up with a wooden spoon. Drain the beans and add them and the rosemary to the pan. Cook while stirring until the beans start to pop and the lamb is getting dark brown about six to eight minutes. Add the vegetables and continue cooking on a medium heat for about 10 minutes. Stirring occasionally. Stir in the flour and then slowly add the stock. Bring to the boil and simmer on a low heat with the lid on for 30 minutes. Preheat the oven to 180 degrees centigrade, 350 degrees Fahrenheit 
or gas mark 4. Change the potato water. Add salt. Bring to the boil and cook for about 15 minutes or until cooked through. Keep an eye on the mince or grand lamb which should remain wet. It will become drier in the oven. Add more stock if it gets too dry. The potatoes are cooked when they can be easily pierced with a fork. Drain the potatoes, add the milk and mash to a smooth consistency. Leave to one side to cool. Transfer the mince, etc. to an oven-proof casserole dish. Spread the mashed potatoes on top of the mince. Take care not to push the potato into the mince. It should have a rough finish so the peaks are browned more. Bake for about 50 minutes or until the potatoes start to brown. Serve with green vegetables or garlic bread.